Good Saturday morning to you. It is Saturday, February the 11th, 25 degrees outside, but it's sunny. I'll show you what's going on out there in a few minutes. We are getting ready to head to indoor baseball. we got five sessions left to get better, hopefully preparing for a successful outside spring and summer. The boys have been working hard, and uh, we're going to go continue to get some work in this morning. <clears throat> um, after that, we're going to probably pick up lunch from somewhere and then head uh, to a few places. Got a few stores to get to. Tomorrow is Super Bowl Sunday, so today is get all the errands out of the way for the weekend and then do nothing tomorrow except sit and eat and watch football. Can't wait. Um, yesterday's video was really, really short. Not much going on, so I apologize about that. Getting ready to... I'm editing that right now, actually exporting it. And then I'm going to upload that here in a little while. So um, we'll try to get more footage today. Yesterday was just one of those busy days where it's like I sat here uh, before I knew it, it was lunch. And then before I knew it, it was pick up. And in the evening, we didn't do anything. Really, so I um, had a couple pieces of toast this morning, a little toast with some light butter on it, and uh, to get some energy going to start the day. So, hopefully, you uh, are having a great Saturday. Hopefully, um, it, the weather is nice where you are. It's just cold here, really, really looks nice out. There's no clouds in the sky, planes have actually been going over pretty low. Uh, I don't know what that means, but um, remember, we're close to the airport, so we hear and see those planes quite a bit. Um, Anyway, we're going to go hit the uh, indoor stuff as the cat is digging through our pile that is going to either go to a garage sale or Goodwill. Maybe she's shopping. All right. Let's go have some fun at the baseball fields. Indoor. Well, not fields. Indoor stuff, right? What's in there? There's bags. She's been pushing these marbles and little balls around, and I think they get stuck in here, and she... I think she should go out. Sorry, I'm, I'm screwing in the uh, little adapter here, so that was probably really loud. What do you see, kitty? See anything good in there? I see a, I see a nine from, from uh, Uno. No marbles. Sorry. Sorry, kitty cat. Well, here we are. Like what? Two weeks later? One week later? And Sonic still hasn't fixed. Backwards menu. So if you want a, I can't even say any of this. Jumbo popcorn chicken backwards. Got uh, Nord. Anyway, the menu is backwards. Down here is fine. Uh, and look, there's our order. Place an order on the app. It's been in the kitchen. It's been there for a few minutes. Ooh, look at that Fritos. Oh. Okay. Well, the food is cooking. I hope it's cooking better than their menu doing. We're still waiting for their food, but look at this. Sonic sells something called ocean water. What the heck do you think that is? And so, uh, what else caught my eye? Oh, look. Well, do you get nerds in your soda? Or your slushy? Grape slush with nerds. Oh, we're losing them. There we go. Strawberry on sweet tea. We got some, uh, quite a few different selections here of drink, but this ocean water is. Huh. Look at this Saturday. 45 degrees. No wind, no clouds. What a day. What a February afternoon, huh? Amazing outside. Look at the sun. Look at this at Kroger, they've got your Barty Girl cupcakes. You can tell you live in the Midwest far away from New Orleans because uh, this is all they got for Barty Girl. But they do look tasty. Here's something weird. Look at this, it's a, it's a Mustang without a spoiler. Isn't that weird? That just looks super weird to me. Sharp looking car though. Hey, here's what we got at Kroger's. You know, some usual stuff, some bags of the, uh, Rice and noodles, we use that a lot. Chicken broth, elbow macaroni, because we're gonna make some macaroni and cheese in the Instapot. Of course, the cookies. We always need eggs. Um, a couple interesting things here. We got wings for tomorrow for the game. We got this boar's head. Uh, what is this, turkey? 
Maple turkey. Look at the cost of that. Holy cow. Eleven sixty. Uh eight sixth of a eight point eight six of a pound. Okay. That's a lot of turkey, but that's a lot of money. And we also got some of this uh cheese too. Oh man, it's not oh there we go. Colby Jack cheese from Horsehead. That's like the Kroger stuff. Um Luke loves it's Oreo. Not it's not the Kroger brand. It's not? No, it's a... Uh... An brand. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's a real brand. So Luke loves Oreo ice cream. <laughs> Philip loves, you guessed it, vividly vanilla. We got these bagel thins to try in the morning. Um, 110 calories. I mean, they're probably more healthy than my banana bread. Okay, here's the find of the day. This is finally in Indianapolis. Has it been here before? We've found it at GFS. We've seen this at GFS, but mostly this is where Heidi grew up near her hometown. Uh, in the old local IGA. But this is the best pulled pork ever. It's called Peyton's. I would say that. It's pretty decent. Look at this. We opened the back door to get some fresh air. Look at that. Look at that view. The weeping willow is miserable in winter. And look at this kitty cat. She's just sitting here. When we walk away and we don't watch her for a while, she goes through that hole right there. But anyway, got the door open because we're cooking. Well, she walked. Hey, Heidi. Hey, what? What are you making? Mashed potatoes. Ah, mashed potatoes. We're going to have mashed potatoes with that. That there is a rotisserie chicken from Costco's. Hey, hey. Hey, turn around. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> What's that? We got indoor, whoa. Indoor sizzle? Indoor sizzle, indoor boil. Indoor boil is different, well, it's similar to sizzle. Uh, one of the flames just shot up the same. Yikes. We got noodles cooking. We got noodles cooking on the stove. And then we got potatoes a-boiling. That's a, some sort of Christmas song. Potatoes boiling and noodles boiling. <laughs> there we go, our noodles are done. Potatoes are smashed, and our chicken's gonna get cut. It's gonna be great. And here we go. Got our chicken off the carcass. Got some noodles, mashed potatoes. It's pretty darn good, doesn't it? It's gonna be delicious. Can't wait. We uh, we just took a an amazing journey back to Christmas. Uh, we watched the movie Violent Night. It's got the guy that was the cop in Stranger Things. What's his name? Do you know what his name is? Uh, Jim. David Harbour. David Harbour. What was his name in Stranger Things, Jim? Hopper. 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 And it's got... Uh, oh my gosh, what's her name? Um, Beverly D'Angelo. Beverly in it. I don't even know what to say. It, first off, it's not for kids. Not for kids. Santa is a... 1100 year old Viking who is here to basically uh, say bad words and kill people. It was uh, amazing. Amazing. I laughed so hard at many times. There were two different scenes. One, Santa's eating a big candy cane and uses it as a sword. And then there's a girl hidden and she sets up all these booby traps like Home Alone. But it's like a violent Home Alone, like a real violent Home Alone. So, anyway. It was good. What what'd you think? What uh one out of five stars, what would you rank it? Uh I'd probably four. Four. It's pretty gory. It was really gory and really a lot of bad language. I would watch it every holiday season. Seriously. I put that in the rotation one time you gotta watch it. I thought it was great. I thought it was hilarious. Oh my gosh, there were so many parts that I was literally laughing. Anyway, our chicken. And our noodles and our mashed potatoes were absolutely amazing. Heidi probably made the best mashed potatoes she's ever made. They were really, really good. It's those little golden potatoes. They just cooked up beautiful. And uh, it, it's... This movie was something else. You guys... Well, sorry, that was really loud. Brought the chicken carcass out. Now, do you guys still have your green light up from Christmas? Accidentally? Also, look at this night we got beautiful evening. Can you see any of the stars? Look at the stars. 
All right, we are walking, looking upstairs, or looking upstairs, looking upward. There's a gigantic hole, you can't see that, it's dark. And here we are. Where's the, I thought I saw the moon. Maybe I didn't. Okay, well, that's the black Indiana sky late on a Saturday evening. You're welcome, but here's the highlight. Look at the little kitty cat. Say hello. 